Um, um, let me see. Let me see if this will let me share. One second. Share. Yes. Oh, that's so beautiful. I don't know if you can hear me. Oh, I can. Now I know oh, that perfect. you can hear me. As it's well. stunning. <laughs> Just sometimes when I put the nail squad, it doesn't... Um... Yes. It's a um, not scent or some crap They're like actually, that. No. They must be working on stuff because let me tell you, it, I never could hear you when you were searching before either. Oh. Come on, that. nail squad. Oh. Here we go, Neil Squad. Share. Awesome. Perfect. There we go. So there's actually a launch today, December 15th. Hi, Thank Gina. You, Gina. It is white and black matte texture gel paint. So this is like all of their gel paints. It sorry. Someone to catch in my throat. It cures with a no wipe but there's never been one that cures matte so i think that's really interesting let me just click i don't know if they have a write-up i'm so excited like i didn't even this was a huge surprise from our representative i had no clue that this was coming so this was definitely a very beautiful christmas surprise so it actually looks as though they're not in a bundle you get them individually and they are for 29.95 or if you have vip they are $14.98. They also have a special going. If you become a, a brand new VIP today, you get your first polish for $0. So you can actually get one of these for $0 down with your order. And don't they retail $29.99? $29.90. So, so you're literally getting like a $30 product for free and 50% yes. off and whatever else you get. So there's all sorts of sales and goodness going. Awesome. So I'm just going to quickly scroll through. So as I said, you can get them individually. And it says it's a no wipe, white texture art gel paint. So it's hard. Hi. That, that sis right there. She was giving me a bare laugh this morning. Oh, uh, highly, <laughs> highly pigmented oh, no. with medium viscosity. <laughs> the gunk. Yeah. I wish you had read some of the comments, Mama. Like, we have Gina is a stand up comedian. She's too, she's too funny. She's she did it. amazing. <laughs> uh, so it says if it's used alone, no top coat needed. When using textured art gel paint in combination with other gels, a top coat is needed, but you can use a sponge in order to not lose the texture, which I actually <laughs> learned this when I was doing my um, Nightmare on Elm Street set. Where like I did the build up with the sticky tack, but I didn't mm -hmm. want to lose that definition, so I ended up yeah. going in with a kind of like a sponge. Oh God, yeah. you're so cute, Gina. She's like always ready for a good laugh. Amazing. Oh my gosh. No, yeah, but it's all good. It's all so I'm good. just quickly looking. That was the white. I'm gonna pull up because the honestly, my favorite is the black. Um, it. It really just looks so mystical. And like I was thinking like Halloween time whole, yeah. whole, whole. <laughs> is going down. So here's Definitely. the black texture gel paint and it has the identical right app. So I don't have to read that for you guys. But again, it's a no wipe. And um, yeah, it retails for $29.95. So these are amazing. Mm. These are the two here. Actually, what's really crazy I don't know how well you can see, but like it actually looks like whipped, like you know, like yes. a whipped cream. Mousse. It's very we, yeah, mousse, mousse. It's mousse. very like yes. light and creamy. Yeah, um, and it's really really interesting because as you apply it, like I'll bring these two swatches up close. Let's make sure there's nothing on there. You can really see like the little bumps. So like, do they call it stucco in um? In the UK? No. What You said that earlier on. What is it? Is it a food? So stucco is actually what they put on our ceilings. And it's yes, like these little bits of plaster. Yes, it is. It is. I, I, I don't know the name, but I know what you're talking about. Once you said <laughs> ceiling, uh, I was like, oh, that. I yeah, just needed to it, know what it was to do with because I'm thinking, is it a food? 
it sounded like a, a stacked sandwich or something, a stucco. No. But yeah, not food. <laughs> you know what so I mean? I but did... yeah, I do know what you're talking about. It is a nice right? effect. Yeah. It's a it's a very cool effect. And it almost looks like, you know when we had to achieve those bubbles? Yes. Like it looks like with many the, different little soap. Yes, with the soap. Uh, yes, exactly that. I mean, so, so me what do you think in terms of doing like sweater nails? So I don't do think, think I'll be able to achieve the look I want because of the straight, straight lines. Um, because this is more of a bumpy texture, it's really good for like tweed designs, um, building up like textures in uh, nail art. So like for beards and snow and oh. different things like that. But I don't think you'd be able to get like the definition in the sweater. Uh, but upon playing with the pudding gel earlier, I might be able to stack oh pudding gel. We're in the bathroom gym of... again. Sorry. Oh, what did you say? It's becoming a bit of a habit. We're in the bath with her again. It's okay, okay. sister. There's nothing wrong with that. So I wonder, this has been cured for a little while. Do you think I could still get chrome on there? Yes. Okay, well, we're going we're gonna to find out. The only reason why I say that is because sometimes I can just go back to a nail after days and just well, think Remember chrome. when I said I was at the salon and the lady literally wiped off my... Yes, perfect for filigree. Hi, Priya, honey. She, like, wiped off the tacky layer and then... Oh, Lord started putting the, the chrome on and I'm like, I didn't know that was a thing. I thought you needed that layer. Uh -huh. But this is what I've come to realize. All chrome is different. Some chromes like a base coat. Some some chromes won't do jack crap with base coat. Um so it's just it's just that. So mama made a really good suggestion where she said if I had like a ombre or a baby blender brush that was more like the round brush with bristles that I can yes. really get into the grooves of this. Uh, yeah. I don't, I really have to work on my brush game. That's actually like my new year's resolution. <laughs> I want to get some better of those makeup brushes that, you know, um, I actually do, but I had a mess spill on L9. So I have to get on all fours to go find it behind the desk. Oh yeah. No, let's see. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, I'm going to scream. You okay? Oh, it's going on like a dream. Oh, there you go, sis. I'm seeing something there. So now, sis, when we went back to our dragon, imagine you put the texture gel, but you leave a negative space. Yeah. And in that negative space, you could have your eye. Yes. Okay, so you could definitely get that because this gives, this yeah. is giving, and let me see when it focuses. And then the freaking, the fact that the pudding gels go nicely on top, because watching, um, oh, sis, it's got that green Oh, my eye. gosh, I'm, I'm freaking out. Let me see if I can turn sis. the flash on. Ooh, 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 ooh. So cool. Do you see the flash? It's so cool. Oh, oh my, my gosh. gosh. Okay, y'all, this is the magic of trying new products. Ruby's this is still honestly... down with chicken pox. Okay, I'm so sorry. Oh, no. This Gina, is really mystif kind of like mystifying me. I've never tried a texture gel before, and I was honestly picking Mama's brain like crazy. Like I haven't either. I've only ever seen it, but honestly, it's not even what I was thinking. So, why I'm saying that is to do a little test with this one. If you put, um, like how you put it on the nail before you cure it, using uh maybe a a dotting tool. Or like an arrow yep. tool. See if you can carve a shape and see if it stays separated. Oh, because... yes, it will. It's okay. highly viscous, so you know what we'll do? We'll go back in. What color do you want me to use, honey? Well, honestly... Go in back in with the black because that can go with the, the texture of the dragon, like the kind of like that green color. Yeah, I mean, you could do that. I mean, your base, is that your base there? That's white. I have this white. I like pre did this one, and yeah. um, because I was gonna try the sweater, but it was before I opened it. And okay, then as okay. soon as I opened it, I was like, "Oh, this is really yeah, cool." Yeah, I think the black. It's not, it's not what I, I don't expected. Know why I'm thinking the black. So if you've put base coat down already and everything, I'm just trying to think. 
maybe so you might should have to I do, do a white. completely different nail than this? And put the black on by itself? Well, I think so, because when Votino does it, the texture, he puts it on a blank nail. Okay, so, so I have a blank nail right here. Yeah. You know, you know, if you stay ready, you don't got to get ready. So That's let me grab... Got to get our little crystal, because... Oh! Oh, Ru, we... Little Ruby, we love you, honey. Oh, gosh. Oh, yeah. Chicken Pox is trying to... I just, you know, happy she's got it now and then she'll be fine for Christmas, you know? That's what I mean. Like, any kind of sickness around Christmas time, even this little flu that's trying to come around you, it doesn't know that you have a sister that can throw a punch, eh? Trust me. Don't, don't, make, don't make it come out because, yeah, I'm nice and sweet until you mess with my family. Then you're going to catch these hands. Just saying. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, so it. I'm just cleaning this off. So I'm so hyper vigilant right now. Like this stuff, I've never seen anything like it, and I don't want any kind of contamination. So actually, like even in the quick video I did, I actually just used this to scoop some out, which it definitely makes the Dairy Queen test. We're just gonna do a light scoop here so I can show you guys. It's it's crazy. So this is the inside, which just looks like as mama said, moose whipped magic. Oh. But this kind of reminded me of like asphalt or I don't know why this thing is having such trouble focusing. Do you see how, like, the Dairy Queen, that's, like, yeah. not going anywhere? Not going nowhere. So I'm going to quickly cover. I might need a little bit more than that to cover this nail. This nail is huge. Okay. You know we got to use our zeros. Uh-huh. Hold on. Okay, let me grab... One of the million brushes we got here. <laughs> okay, and swipe, swipe. See, this is just so satisfying because oh. the coverage is really cool. And it's such a, I don't know, it's a real easy. Priya, please don't catch another cold. So that's how I feel. I was trying to tell Stefan this hay fever. They said, Mom, there's no hay fever in this cold weather. <laughs> I said, I, like, said I know there's allergies. seasonal allergies. Yeah. But... You know, he was just laughing at me. Uh, that went down so nice. Right? Did that not Did that not go down amazing? Uh, see, that had me weak. That's why I was wondering if it could be smooth. But I see the shine that you are mentioning. Yes, there's quite a, quite a shine in there. And it almost oh, looks and like... And this is watching it from not the screen I'm on, the other phone. I'm watching it from oh. that. Oh, wow, um, really? Yeah, so, and I can see what you mean about that little shine. So, yeah, this is the test of tests. I mean, oh, you can fine. do anything. You could do... You, you really can. <laughs> From the time I saw how easy this just went on here, I was shook. Yeah. I was like, it actually just, like, gripped so effortlessly. Really beautiful. I'm going to grab a tool right here and just do what Ooh. Mama was saying. Yeah, so just see So what kind of, like, markings did he do? Um... He did like a swirly one, so sort of like um, if you think like a like a shell, like a like a seashell, or you know, um, you could do yeah, that's what he did. So I saw him use like one of them. He used a brush, but I think to know what's best, just see if when you use that tool in your hand, you can get everything off. If not. And you feel like you need a brush, then maybe yeah. See, because I want to know, can you clean off with like alcohol? But he normally uses a sharp tool. When he did the dragon eye, that's what he did. You could do crisscrosses, just you know. I'm just surprised that like you really can carve into it. I'm just and it's not here. it's not spilling back. No, 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 yes. no. You see, so that gives me hope. They will definitely come out with a smooth one. I think this was smart to come out with an option because there right. is currently a smooth texture gel in the market. But now to have a texture, texture gel, amazing. Yeah, this is really cool. So I'm just really scoring out like really tiny pieces. Anything, sis. Anything, yeah. But I'm and then just once you're happy, cute. Then I just but wonder. You're going... just you're just doing some carving there. Like, what is she doing? But like, do you see even in here the scores? Yeah. 
I can't believe this. Yes, yes, sister. We got a texture. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god you're so sweet okay i did i did something right i heard you like give the excited squeal. yes we okay, have we'll get back into our chrome which i was okay, actually so Korea, don't worry she said she's gonna be quiet about watching oh no problem sis all the sisters oh, yeah. are here whether that be in spirit or actually in the room so i'm gonna dip back into this red iguana Oh, did that cure already? I was just about to. So I did it for a full minute. So I just oh, wanted to gosh. dip into this and get this on here. So, so that I the can... 60 seconds, definitely, it cures it and everything. So we know that we've tested that. And that's nice. You've put a nice thin layer. Oh, my God. And this is only one layer. The ones that I did on the previous swatch earlier, uh -huh, these uh -huh. were two okay. thin coats. Okay. But I was very impressed. Like, you can very much build it up. And it's the same mm -hmm. thing, like, this is why I had a question. Maybe oh, our bubble. next live, we can play around. Definitely. Um, because you have the white pudding gel. Yeah. And I actually thought if you put that on smooth, you can carve into that, and that will create a textured, smooth look. I so think I so. Think the leather achieve... look, at least. I think that leather look, you could achieve it with that, definitely. I never thought about the pudding gel, but you're right, because it's, it, it, it stays in place. It doesn't move, which is what you want. With the gel polish, you know, you score a line, you turn around, it's... It will back. just, exactly, this this stuff will not. Okay, so oh, I want to do a... I have one called contour gel. Okay, Gina. Ooh. Let's look into that. I Ooh. want to find, like, a dusty, um, almost like a tree bark color chrome, because looking at this, this looks like a wood. Mm. Oh, I know the color you're saying, yeah. But I've seen Votino mix chromes together to make another yes. color. Yeah, so. for sure. So I'm going to have to get out um, like a base that oh. I don't care about because it's going to get chrome everywhere. But we want to we want to see here. This is insane. This is really cool to work with. I get yeah, the, dragon, oh. the dragon feel instantly. This is actually like kind of like a unicorn horn too. Yeah, and that... That's that's what I was thinking because I was thinking the swirls. What are the swirls? But yeah, the unicorn. Yes, yeah, the unicorn oh, definitely yeah. has the swirls. And to anyone that did not see Mama's live this morning, head over to Mama Does Nails YouTube. You are going to be mystified. She shows you oh, this with morning. an amazing tool. We're not going to give any spoilers, but uh -huh. using a Madame Glam tool. That's so versatile that you can create fine, fine lines and really pretty art. Oh, it was so fun, honestly. So, so fun. Oh, I'm losing it over these texture gels. I mean, you know, the thing is, we'll find other ways. We'll find stuff to do. Because, <laughs> I know, I'm even thinking, if you did the texture gel, can you file it? You... Oh, I'm sure you can, yes. So that means that's that... even what Lauren was saying. I went back mm. and looked okay, at the video. Okay, you watched it, yeah. And mm. she was saying if it's too bumpy for you and you don't like it and you've done a design on fingers, you can just take your buffer mm. and just buff that out. Oh, my heavens. <gasps> Life. Okay, also, why did this give the chrome dimension and now it looks like like holiday paper? It's definitely giving me dragon, though. Yes. Oh, my goodness. Know, there's something very dragon about this. So now I'm thinking you could actually leave a negative space for the eye and do yep. this around, you know, yep. and really texturize and still chrome. I think we could, you know, not every dragon has got scales. Our dragon has got textured skin. And the moment you see this texture, it still gives the appeal of, like, yeah, something mystical, or yeah. something magical you know oh, sis can you imagine next shirt. halloween the skin oh, oh my gosh that's a, right next halloween it's going down because like this nah, too you can literally it can literally literally be just ripped and it's just hanging because like watching lauren do that snowflake today it was so rustic i was just like yes it was a very rustic i did mm. love that so i wonder i don't know if we have enough still left on here because i don't know this chrome, what it will look like on the white if we'll get some pearlescent 
Yeah, you should. I heard him today. Today he put a unicorn chrome on top of white and it and it gives it that sort of like a blue undertone. I don't know oh. if that's the same color the unicorn chrome will come out. But you when people say unicorn like, chrome, I'm like, which one? That Aurora? Yeah. So see, this is what's really cool because again, if you're not into textures, you can still use this to create a very like multi-dimensional look. Like, I'm gonna show you right here where I'm gonna kind of even it out. And you're not going to feel that texture. So, like, if textures are an issue for you, yeah. you're going to oh get a very God. individualized design. Do I love that? Wow. It's really... I I hate... Let me turn down my... It's having some yeah, crazy it looks focus issue. So smooth. But it's really pretty. Let me dip back into this no wipe top coat. I'm very grateful. They also sent out a peel off base coat and a no wipe top coat. It's like they knew that I used my entire peel off base coat for a checkerboard or something. Oh my gosh, that's awesome. <laughs> Sorry, not awesome that <laughs> you did that with your peel off base coat, but you know what I mean. Right? Oh. oh, mama. Okay, so this is giving like crushed up emerald vibes. But you didn't have to do anything. Like, literally, the texture gel and the chrome uh -huh. create something completely different. Something different, yes. I thought so. Because if you think of all the grooves in it, it's like you're gonna the chrome's going to kind of be on top and then at the bottom. I mean, yeah. this design, imagine using this texture gel, putting that chrome down, putting more texture gel on top, more chrome, and then file. Yep. And getting, like, the different bumps, like a jawbreaker yes. almost, right? Yes. But, like, I really... Yes. This is like multi-dimensional. It's oh, really, I can really see cool. It. Why does it look cat eye? It does. It looks cat eye, doesn't it? It's the cat eye without. Yeah. And you wouldn't think, looking at that texture at first, like you could create something like this. No, it, it just almost feels like it's separated the chrome and it's just all gone in. Yeah, then you can even texture other areas with acrylic powder, um, um, Gina said. Yeah. Gina, that part. Oh my gosh, sisters, we need to have a play date. Right? We can have a big WhatsApp play date because we can have up to eight people on WhatsApp. That part, yes, we need to have a big WhatsApp, WhatsApp, WhatsApp yeah. play date. That's me. Christmas is probably just going to be sure. me and the boys. So, um, yeah, they're going to be doing what they're doing. So I'll probably end up at my nail table. <sighs> I love that Raven. So you just let, I, let I don't know. Going. Like this, it's almost like I need to get mine. Literally put the chrome on it, just like you've done, to yep. really see what you've just done there. Mm -hmm. Because I just feel like I know it's not giving. If what I'm seeing, I'm seeing. I already know it's not giving me everything. Oh, trust me, you're gonna be so shook when you see this in person. And that's why I thought, like, oh, I wanted goodness. to do a Christmas. Yes, Gina, ready for it. Uh huh. I wanted to do like a Christmas land um, tree from the nightmare before Christmas. And even the grooves on this look like the tree. Like I can't believe like just from it's swiping true. down. Like it's it's very impressive. And what um, Lauren said was right. Because she said these are the only two colors you'll ever need. It's and true. for instance, if I went to like the local craft shop and I got some acrylic alcohol inks, for instance, like brown and light brown and stuff like that i'm like completely convinced i could do uh, like insane wood like where you would just think this was a slice of wood that got cut out definitely because it just like yeah this is very impressive because all these lines are getting downward this is actually from the stripe of the brush let alone what i've carved out exactly so it truly like I'm I'm very impressed with this. Like Madam William definitely definitely thought. Like I don't know who's thinking up this magic, but well, for me, as I said, you know, we are bringing nails are coming to life. I mean, the three D, you know, with all sorts of different, and this this is just another thing that we needed. We needed it. Wow. No, yeah, this is definitely something that was needed. And um, <coughs> this is a big game changer, like huge. No, it is. It is. I said that to our rep today. I said to her, you know, 
I don't know if you know, I said, but definitely is. I mean, for Madam Glam, because you just think, oh, yeah, you know, polishes. No, bro. You know, and I think now I don't even know what to think in a sense. I'm saying I think, but, you know, that whole thing of where they're going next. I mm -hmm. love it. They're innovative. They're trying new things. So, you know, I'm there for that. So look at this oh little guy, Mama. I saved this one. <laughs> This do you save this one too? Yeah. So this one to me felt like me, like mystical gonk, you know? Yeah, like, yeah, with, with, the, the, with the little stars. Yeah, with the, the star little bird. stars, because like that's my whimsical dream, you know what I mean? And then I thought this beard, this could be really fun with the what's it called? With the texture gel. With the yes. Right? Let me see. see the little beard and the starch and all that. Just trying to think that, like, ice gray color is so beautiful. I don't know. Okay. Oh, wait. I can't. I can't even say it yet. Because there was um, there was something. I was doing some filming for the advent. And there was I me, mean, like, very much by surprise. But it's going to be tomorrow's unboxing. Or, you know, I can't, can't say anything. But after this message, me, please, because there was something I saw. And I was just very shocked. But I'm saying to myself, like, why are you doing this to yourself? Just open the box. See what's in day 16. That part? Oh, my God. I really do love the, like, the daily filming, though, waking up, and then I run over, and I'm like, what's in the box? <laughs> okay, let me grab out some colors here. I can yeah. also say with, like, great excitement that, oh, what fun, the chalet time also arrived. Oh, yes, you said them to arrived as well, yeah. Oops, oopsie daisy here. <laughs> this. I wonder, just trying to figure out, I really do like this, like, dusty blue and this red. But what would you say, Madam Glam, that's like this, Aloha? Sorry. Um, that's what I'm looking at. Yeah. It's exactly the one I picked up. This one. Aloha, right? Yeah. That's the closest That's I one I would say, definitely. Because it also looks like velveted. It's been velvet. Yeah, once you mat that, oh. it's going to look stunning. That's also what I said, honey. You when you send Car Karina your... <gasps> you saved it! This is what I'm when saying. When you send Karina um, your live today... Yeah mention that if it's possible like maybe you know the next next month or what have you if you can try the velvet mat because when oh, i watched yeah. you do the gonk i was truly mystified and like for them to have a talent like yours on their team it's just like it's insane like you just you literally did like a live workshop and unboxing with their product and i just thought like i know that karina would like love to put that in in your hands so that you could just showcase the, the mat, you know. Yeah, no, I'll definitely do. I will definitely ask her. I keep always forgetting about the mat. Because um yeah just watching you do that design today I was just like I know I know if Karina knew that you didn't have that. Uh, I, I don't know how I keep the game. Like, oh my god, this blue. Okay, so y'all, we're gonna do a little throwback. This is from the Glamorous Paradise collection, and this was inspired by Hawaii. Mm -hmm. This Aloha, oh, even just looking at it against the blue that's already on my nail, that's just stunning. How is everybody doing in the chat? We have a Priya and Gina. I thought I saw something else pop up, but yeah, sadly, if um if we don't see a comment, even if it shows a number change, we can't see who entered. That's the one thing I hope that YouTube does change because it would be nice to, even if they're not able to respond because some people, you know, they've already flat out said like, hey, sometimes I'm turning this on while I'm in the bath or when I'm cooking dinner or you know what I mean? So it would be nice to be able to greet even if, um, if, 
okay. or is busy, you know? Okay. So they suggested, like, with these, mm -hmm. your gel paints, mm -hmm. you don't have to worry about top coating or doing any of that. But if you're using anything else, so the pudding gels, yes. the regular mm -hmm. gels, make mm -hmm. sure to top coat. Because you're not going to have sealed that in at all. Keep that. And, um, okay. um, that, that's that really doing, impressive. Um, that's one coat. I don't have to go back in there. Not doing anything. Um, no, I got to plug in. Oh, no way. You know, because I had to do the whole camp outside of my front <laughs> to get my package today. So my phone was with me the whole time. I should have had the foresight to keep it charged. No. But even though I didn't have like Wi-Fi, I was like, you know how you feel safe. I know it sounds so silly, but like to have your phone make your, if you had to do anything, emergency, anything like that. No, it's true. It's so true. <clears throat> so uh, I'm just looking for my ultra liner. This is just what I want to play with. I just want to do this. <gasps> so Sis. Oh my gosh, yes. Yes, 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 yes. So Please. I just, yeah, just want to play with that. Got nothing pressing. Oh my gosh. Also, sis. And this might sound a little like greedy of me, but I would love if one of our lives that we do, if we could have a woven day. Like I really, I have the artist, the master right before me. And I would love for you to teach me because I want to make a whole video, but like I need practice. So I would love it if, if we could practice yes. together. <laughs> my sister and I'll be there, I'll be there. <laughs> because it's something which I love stuff like that anyway you know we did get the dotting tool as a gift in the calendar so like being able to show different things you can do with the dotting tool and like the different liners they have yeah. and honestly I, I had so many dotting tools never really took them really seriously because you just think dotting tools are, are just dotting tools. But honestly, there are things that you can do to a dotting tool to make them even more special. And that's what I think they did because I love that dotting tool now. Isn't this, that's my favorite dotting tool to use. And you can either make but, really big dots or like super tiny. Ooh, Pink Liberty. Give yeah. me Pink Liberty or nothing at all. Justice. <laughs> Justice for all. Oh gosh, now I'm doing my head in because I don't know if I want to do red or purple. Oh my gosh, stop this. Oh. Okay, these flash gels though, I am like, I feel very honored to be able to hold this. Like, I don't take this for granted because this sold out very quick. And like, these are, yeah. I knew it. I'm hoping in the new year they'll have some new stock. Yeah, it all sold out except the only holographic that's available still is oh what fun oh my gosh that's literally the only one available like it it was fast sis like freaking fast okay i'm just looking for but honestly i think when people actually saw the the color story they lost it like they just lost it in a good yeah. way just like i have to have this kind of thing you know but Lauren was showing their other holographic set. And remember how I sent you um, and the sisters like a little message about some of the other holographics they yes, had? Yes, you did. So I would like to go through, like, obviously, financially, you know, Christmas is very tough. New Year. And maybe we can all pick some some colors and stuff because it was just, it floored uh, me. You're, you're talking about a collab now so we can reach out to our rep. <gasps> yeah. Yes, that part. Yep. Yep, 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 yep. Because um, when you said that, things, I didn't even realize. There's two things I wanted to do New Year's wise. So I wanted uh, the Charm Sister New Year's collab, which will be from all the context of the box because all four of us have advent calendars. So okay, I thought yeah. in the new year, we could do something like where we combine some of our favorites. So not like everything out of the box, but 
you know, some some goodies that you found that you really liked? Trust me. Yesterday, oh my gosh, I was so gassed. So gassed yesterday. The best year ever. Right? Okay. W were you not losing it over that? I was well, just like, you know what, Madam Glam? Bet. Because it has been. And it's been because of, cause of you and my beautiful sisters. And, you know, I opened... forgot to tell you guys, I have a code and link for Kiara Sky. Sis! Congratulations! That's huge! Oh, who's that? Uh, oh, sorry, Miss Gina. Oh, yes, Gina, bring it. We will definitely um, promote that code in our if you if our you lives just and it. all sorts. If you'd like to share it, honey. Okay. I am still so shook at how easy this is to paint with. I've still never found a sparkle polish or something that you can oh. actually like draw with. This is this is what I I was saying today. I I was shook because you know I've done the plaid, but this was still something different today. Just drawing with it, even the heart. It's not, um, you know, like the glitters or the pieces in it. They they um they move really nice. They they're just smooth. It looks like it would cure with a texture base. A texture feel, but no, it levels out amazing, it really does. So, and I've got some like little polishes that look like that, and you just can't wait to top coat that, like literally. Yeah, it's just, just almost feels like gross and mm. like sometimes that you know, if you want the feeling, yeah, I like like glitter, like sugared glitter, like this. I like this. I See, because like that's texture. intentional, though, right? Yeah. So, like, if it's but... supposed to be, that's a different story. Mm. Definitely. So. Just want to try this and just see if I like it. Just, it's just another thing, literally, to tick off the list to try. Like, honestly. If you like what, honey bun? No, the design that I'm just going to play with today. It's just another thing oh, that... Oh, it's gorgeous, you know. though. As soon as I saw that, I was melting. Mm, no, thank you, sis. Like, we save all these images and just never get around to use, especially seasonal images, gets me because I'm just like, oh. Yep. Well, like, I have been saving even pictures of these little gnomies, the gonks, for, like, ever. And it was, like, I feel like everything just felt more important. You know what I mean? Like, you keep prioritizing all of this stuff. And this morning, honey, like, you were such a light this morning for me. I, I had a really rough morning. And as soon as your live went off, I was like, you know what? I will love to click this because I know it's going to feel like home. And it's going to be uplifting. And I'm going to see magic. But I wasn't prepared for a full-all webinar on gnomies and gonks and all of the things like you slayed sis like that was just a whole experience honestly thank you but that's what i'm saying now it's just having that that belief in yourself and not feeling scared and to the point where even if someone sees it and they think it's crap i'm like you know serves you mate you're, you're entitled to your opinion think what you like mm -hmm. um, i agree it's 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 just that art is art, man. I think if Banksy was one was sitting down there wondering whether people would think this or that of his art, he just would not be nowhere. I'm yeah, and I I'm sorry, sis. I have seen in the streets of New York some questionable paintings that sell. You know what? Oh. If it's from your heart, ain't nobody can't tell you it's nothing but art. Okay. Thank you. So we are going in with some Bean Town. This is a gorgeous nude, and oh. I want. Um, oh, isn't that pretty? Pretty nude. That's going to be for the little nosy nose. We don't need much of that. I'm really learning how like the perfect amount now 
because I used to put way too much on my palette. I, I don't know what I was trying to paint, like a whole, <laughs> a oh, whole stop scene, it. apparently. And uh, it's it's just measuring it sometimes, you know, just getting that ratio and you're just like, you know, you don't want to waste it, but you also just want enough. Especially yeah. if you're working, you don't want to keep having to go back in, but. But I actually um, didn't realize because like, you know, certain companies that we started off with, you needed a lot more um, product, if you will. So I'm actually forgetting that a lot of products we're working with now are so highly pigmented in such a wonderful formula, whether that be yeah. cream or even this flash formula that like you don't need as much, right? You really don't. Less oh, is more. oh my God, Gina's laughing at Beantown. Bean Town, what's coming to your mind, Gina? Like flick your bean, Bean Town. I cannot deal. Is that really the name? Oh yes, because um, Boston, honey, Boston is known as Bean Town. And this was inspired by Boston. That's right. <laughs> oh my God, he's already coming to life. Oh my God. <laughs> it looks so stinking cute. I can't. Oh, I can see him. Yes. Oh my god. Again, like this is I've never drawn one of these guys before. This is definitely the first time. But there is some amazing, like this young woman. Um, see, this is what I hate. Oh, good. Henriette. Okay, because I hate sometimes on Pinterest, they don't do a good job of crediting the artist. So this is Hen Henriette nails and i've seen henriette before she slays at these pictorials um let me zoom out here for a second there we go yeah she really slays at these different tutorials but i was thinking for like the shading on his beard i can go back in with a color afterwards uh -huh. but with the texture you're gonna get this it must be a very happy place yes Yes, everyone's flicking the bean, Gina. No, <laughs> I can't. Oh my god. Okay, oh my god. I do need to clean this little brush here. Bean Town is where it's at. I really do love um the Boston collection, the nudes. They're really gorgeous. I was actually going in between those nudes or the nude pudding gel. But um, okay. this was really given everything and more. I actually want to do like a full gong set with all of the, the um, Boston colors. So I have like a, a quality like, with all different um, skin tones. You're gonking mad. I'm gonking mad. Yeah, you've made me gonking mad after inspiring me with your gonk. Say that ten times fast. <laughs> I bet you never knew when you set out to do this nail journey that you'd be inspiring women to gonk it all over the place. But gonk you did. Gonk it out. I'm telling gonk you. Gonk it out. Gonk it out. <laughs> so I just turned the flash off so you guys could really see this like real yummy consistency. Just dipping back in here. I'm really nervous about contaminating this like wonder magic. So I just keep taking a little scoop here and I'm going to put that down on the palette. This is a lot of fun, y'all. Like I turn this upside down. It doesn't even move. So this is really showing you. You guys can even like layer it to really get different effects. Oh. Like it's, uh, it's very responsive. I like that. Okay, let's turn back on that light. I felt so bad when you said that earlier in the, um, did I not cure this? Who am I? Who am I? You need to cure. Oh my God, stop this. <laughs> you know, and see, this is what Madam Glam will do. It will get you feeling so secure in yourself. Uh. You'll forget to cure. <laughs> okay, there we go. Got a healthy amount on that brush. And again, like, 
you can see this is really just staying wherever you have it. And again, what mama was saying is right. If you've seen other texture art, sometimes they're working with like a smooth. This is very textured. So it has more of a bumpy, but it's really cool because those bumps can add to dimension. So really give you a very unique nail. Like you wouldn't just get this if you put that chrome onto a black nail. So uh -uh. it's these kind of things that really are game changers because yeah, just I don't know, to, it just gives you that that freedom. It give you something different, right? Exactly. Like this is very unique. <laughs> very very unique. That's awesome. I can really understand how they were getting those, uh, what's it called, vibes? Yeah. Tweed. Maybe I should be banned from commenting. No, sis, Why? we love it. We love it so. Yes, Medusa does do that too, sister. I just saw that flash up. So like when trying to get more fine lines, I did take off a lot of the product so I could get around the nose without it being too gritty. I should have definitely went in here with a white before I went in. But that's okay. We're just gonna, this is the fun of learning. But this is giving such a cool texture yeah but only when we've done something sometimes do we think oh yeah we could have done it like so my brain always needs that one even if it's the and honestly it that's work why out. I sent you like a message earlier and, and talked to you about the gong because like I really do want to do a full set, but in the same aspect, I want to try like to even do one. <laughs> like you want to do a whole set, you should probably Yeah, that's that's number. what today that's literally what today was about. And that's what I was saying to you. Like it's just, you know, just to try it because as I said, I, I only found out about them like last year, but it was like towards the end of Christmas. And I was saying that the truth is. I didn't feel as confident last year. Well, let me tell you, sis, I'm happy that you're building your confidence because you're truly a very inspiring artist. And like I, everything that I see you do, I'm just like, that's a mama original. Oh my God. Like how did she even think of this? Like you're, you're a genius. So just thank you for sharing your art with us and inspiring. And we, we definitely all inspire one another. Definitely do. Definitely Sorry if anybody's been commenting. I got lost in the texture here. Having fun. Yes, let me lift my head up. Congrats, sis. The gonk looks amazing, Priya said. Oh, thank you, Queen. Clear. Medusa does that too. I'm trying to think. Oh, do you mean the um the Dairy Queen test? I'm sorry, I got real lost in the sauce here. <laughs> yeah, this, this is what I love about new products, though, is it really just ignites that creativity and, you know, you just, you get to try something you've never tried before. Yeah, and just, you got to push it to its limit. And only then will you know. I mean, the conversation today started with, oh, yeah, we think it's going to be this and that. And honestly speaking, I just didn't want to even believe it because even when I looked on the VIP section, I could see it. I could see that it had texture in it, but I'm still telling myself that maybe it will, it will, it will smooth out, you know, it will get smooth. <laughs> <laughs> and meanwhile, when I read it, I was thinking of freaking 
um spider gel i'm thinking that's the texture gel not even that and then as soon as you said oh you forget to cure it yes oh my god it's the same with medusa yes thousand percent oh like, yeah Did okay I yeah cure this? <laughs> let me tell you how that time i was i was swatching the lids of the medusa i done swatched the lids sis some of them i'd even put in the lamp mm. so it wasn't until the next time I went in the back, like the staff, and I was like, why is there polish everywhere? Everything I touched was polish. And I was like, wait, there's little circles, yep. but there's nothing on it. Just mm -hmm. like evidence, there was something here. And that's when I realized, I was like, oh, wow. You really just put that down, they didn't kill it. Right? And you're like, you just, you just, zero qualms. You're like, oh, what? I was convinced it was already cured. I'm telling you. Get some H2O. Hmm. I think I might have to use the detail these parts only because what we'll soon see <clears throat> okay so <laughs> I tried to just go over his nose and it got even bigger and I'm like you know what it's still cute though Got this cute little nose poking through. Yeah. I said the nose makes up for no eyes. Seriously. Seriously. <laughs> oh my gosh. I'm just where the heck did I put my white and black gel paint? Did you find it? I didn't, honey, but I'm going to go. What I was trying to avoid was I wanted to use the black gel paint because it's like a no wipe. I did find the white. Uh-huh. I feel honored my wifey is doing some... Some work beside me. Hi, Queen of Bling. Hey, Queen of Bling. Oh, oh. to be beside me. Feels great. How are you doing, sweetheart? Okay. Oh, that's awesome. You know, I got a soft spot for hippie dreadheads named, you know, you know what? We'll just say stay here. Yes, you do. She has her headphones in, so she didn't even hear all that. Oh. Yeah, she has her headphones in. She's definitely... In Stagerland. <laughs> oh. I think. I don't know. Oh, I'm glad. Okay, cool. So they did some shading here. Again, I would, I wish, let me just quickly double check if I can find this paint so i love how fine as well the the paint is for doing little line work like that yeah
think the only frustrating thing is like a transitional phase and you know that some of your stuff isn't exactly organized the way you want it. So it's a bit tough, but I did put most of my stuff in those really nice um, organization. um, Those like, I don't know, what would you call it? Like those totes? Okay. um, Almost like a... So I'm going to wipe this off. Uh, These guys, if I... Um, I'm saying something like that's a material base. Oh, yes. So I have mostly everything organized in there. Uh-huh. To... You know, our stuff has a mind of its own. It likes to walk off and do whatever it might. Oh, perfect. Okay. So they were in one of those tubs, but just in the other one, the white and black were stacked. I wonder what I was doing. Art. That part. I was like, I don't wonder. I was definitely doing some kind of character art. And that is that. Okay, so we are just cracking... I really love Bean Town. It is so perfect for this. this oh. It's a really beautiful skin tone. Love her. Oh boy. Okay, so this happens sometimes. Have you ever had this happen? What's that? Sorry. This oh, is this, your... that something else stuck on it. No, this is the black gel paint, but oh. when it comes out from the pot. Yes. Oh my gosh, that freaked me out the first time. I was like, please, let it still be in the bottom, please. Right? But I think it was Ski Fire. She is a genius. She said, get some sticky tack, put a little yes. tiny, I, tiny I bit. Think I, re- I think I remember when she was saying that. And that happened to one of my other with another brand um same thing it just literally just came from the bottom and out oh my god sis whenever i'm talking to you next please remind me i've got to get gloves all this filming for vlogmas ho 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 there's no gloves oh stop this <laughs> So what's really cool is that though the black and white te- um, texture gel paint is in the same gel paint tubs, it has more of a hybrid in between the gel paint and the pudding gel. And oh. this hybrid is a no wipe, which the pudding gel is not. So this is very, very fascinating. Oh, I got to get some base. Drop the base now. Base coat. Oh my gosh. There we go. Mama, this nail you're doing is turning out spectacular. Thank you, sis. I I mean the original one, they left the gaps, but I um I want to do something else to mine. Oh, then it's cool and everything, but I just wanted more color. Make this look 3D or something. Texture away. Yeah, I'm really impressed with this texture gel. Like, very, very, very much impressed. So out there, though. I wasn't expecting that. 
Yeah, either was I. That's why, like, when I quickly, before we went live, swatched it, I kind of took myself back. I was like, oh, oh, okay. This this was not what I was expecting, but this is cool. Like, this is really cool. Oh. Well, let's say it was a cold day in England today. Oh, gosh. Right? I think, like, there's definitely stuff going on with global warming. Yeah. Most definitely, sis. And the thing about it is, it's just, you know, there was a time when people were just talking about it. But everyone can say, you know, even if you're not seeing it in your country where you're living now, it's happening in other places. Because when my mom said rain, I was like, what? And she herself said it. In her whole time growing up, it's just never rained. Um, in December in in Sierra Leone. Yep. So it was it was just kind of scary. My mom is seventy one. We are well, having insane, like even the memories that I shared with you sisters last year. Oh. In comparison to how it is right now, it's like it's shocking. That's great, crazy. Even a month ago, I was almost upwards to my calf in snow like a year ago where i was sending uh. you guys pictures and all sorts of stuff and that we didn't get our first big snowfall until just like right now which is like not typical for us at all it's mad it's like it's happening oh my gosh so I saw some like really cool. Didn't you look that way? Oh, like you it made him look brown. like a very like a scary gnome that wanted to attack you in the forest, and that wasn't what I was going for. So I think the bright white is more Christmassy. So we're not gonna... the forest gnome. Yeah, it looked like the forest gnome that would come bite your ankles. Like, it, it that completely changed the vibe. Oh, Raven, so like... stop it. Stop it. <laughs> Did you just say, holy crap. You all heard that. She said, come bite your ankles. Oh, gosh, my sister. I have no chance. It just comes right up from underneath you. You're just like, what? Num, num, num. Right to your Achilles heel. Oh, okay. Nope. Oh, <laughs> oh my God. Day 16 tomorrow, sis. I'm so Can't excited. believe this countdown. This countdown has been crazy. Like, Christmas already is usually pretty shocking for me, like, all of a sudden. But, like, this went by super fast. Like, having you oh. know, the daily calendar and everything else, like, it just made things zoom. I was like, okay, no concern. Every time I keep wondering what day it is, I realize... All I have to do is remember the day of the calendar I've done because um, I just can't believe it. Mm -hmm. so it's like the numbers are matching the days. I'm like, damn. Like, don't you dare blink, sis. So I said in one of the voiceovers, I was like, can we just like time machine it up and like slow it down just a little? Because I, I still want to enjoy the season. And this is just going by too fast now. Sis, that was like how I felt at fall. By the time I found the perfect orange, it is already winter. Like... Me too. Me too. And I am a, a Halloween baby. And I'm like, listen, you can't even blink. 
And then I was seeing all the holiday stuff and I'm like, already? And then, yeah, sure enough, now we really are in it. You extended, pardon me, Halloween for us, but still. Right? I still still have to extend it into the new year. There's plans I had that because of other projects, I just, I couldn't not do. Yes, exactly. But I want to do like a special series anyway, like a Netflix and Nails. So I can really, doesn't matter what season we're in, I can still feature like certain movies and stuff like that. Oh, you so can. Okay, let me cure this before I get overzealous again. I'm just going to... To the two beautiful humans in here, we love you. Happy Thursday. I had to think about it because I'm like, we go live on Wednesdays. It is not Wednesday. (laughs) Even when you said Thursday, I was about to say, no, it's not. It's Wednesday. And I was like, no, it's not. It's Thursday. (laughs) Oh, my God. That was too funny. I was just about to say, sis, it's uh, Wednesday. But then... (laughs) Right? Like, honey, I know you're so excited that you're playing with texture gels, but, like, it's Wednesday. (laughs) We can make it the honorary. Oh, wait a minute. I was going to say the honorary Wednesday, but I like what Priya said better. She said, happy Friday Eve. Yes, Hante. Yep. I prefer that one. You see? Happy Friday Friday Eve. Eve. Oh, Oh, shoot. Sugar biscuits. Okay. There we go. Oh gosh! So, what is the equivalent for sugar biscuits? Biscuits <laughs> in adult, in adult sugar, language. Sugar biscuits in in adult language. Like, what's the swear word? Uh-huh. Oh no! Um, you know, like fudge. When they say fudge, I know what they mean. So, sugar, sugar biscuits. When they say biscuits. sugar cookies, <laughs> I guess it would just be the good old fashioned shit. <laughs> oh. M-G. <laughs> you nodded. Oh my god. I was like, oh, sugar biscuits, fiddle dumps. Ooh. Okay, so not gonna lie, when my email goes off, I get so excited because I've been getting some fun emails, but also some weird ones. So <laughs> I don't know who just decides to find an email address and send weird things to, but I'm not the one. Why do they do that? It's like they've got you on speed dial. It's weird. Oh, my gosh. I already just got some strange spam that was like, are you H-O-R? You already know the rest. I know. Except I something, something that. like, what the heck? I, I didn't consent to all this. What is this? That one was super random. How is it possible that I need to sort do a sorting out again? I know. Oh, honey, that's what just happened. Because, like, I just had my stuff organized. And then, you know, videos, lives, all this stuff. And then I was like, I can't even find, like, <laughs> I can't find nothing. Raven was like, you know, oh, my gosh, thank you. Because I'm over here beating up myself. I'm like, how do you do this, mama? How? Oh, no. It's because, like, for instance, right, when we do manicure roulette, we might pull like 30 colors <laughs> like, I don't know where we're going but it's because we pulled 75 oh. cards so you know you need, you need the colors for all the cards we pick thank you and then uh, all of a sudden you see you've picked out all your chromes all your gel paints all your this all your that and then you gotta put that all back so that shuffle that shuffle sometimes you know yeah. Causes your things to go on a little bit of a walk. Like Toy Story, they've come alive. So I was actually just using the petal brush for shading. That's the really fun thing about Madame Glam's tools is 
you can definitely use it for what it's like stripe or bust for striping. But I actually find the way that the stuff distributes. You okay? The stuff distributes like it's perfect for character art, actually. And I actually, I really love like mapping out my characters with that striper brush. I find that it's like next level. That's one that I don't have. You said the petal brush, right? Um, oh no, the striping. You you don't have the petal? No. Okay, I'll have to remember that. When I do my um VIP order in the new year, I can grab a like few goodies. I'll have some um stuff built up. Also, beautiful humans, if you guys haven't tried the VIP program, I would implore you to do so. Um, for instance, like I've been completely on a ban because like there's moving and all sorts of stuff going on. And uh, when Madam Glam came out with these, let me turn the flash on, these beautiful flash polishes, um, they sent out four to us, which we were incredibly like so, like we felt so blessed to be a part of that launch. But I used some of my VIP credits to get the other two colors because I was so mystified. I know, right? Like I, I had never never seen anything like that and i remember how you were, we were talking about born pretty and i said that like i haven't even tried a reflective gel like my first one technically was that bossy glow in the dark one yes like i've never and that was literally just like a month ago so like i've never i've never really gotten to try a reflective so like getting to see their their polishes in person just these to are see them perfectly, yeah. magic in person and this safe freeze. Oh my gosh. I actually saw Miss Jo. Miss Jo Nailco. She she did all of her nails. Oh, what fun. Aww. And it looks so beautiful. And like if you know anything about Miss Jo, she keeps her nails like really dainty. Um, but they're just so beautiful. Like the color she picks. And if you also know anything about Miss Jo, she rarely does like a pink. She's like a very, she likes the darker colors. Like on her own nails, I mean. She'll do any color in her nail designs. Uh, uh, oh, what fun. Yeah, oh, what fun is so delicious. So I can't wait to put that on my nails. Because, you know, I've always said since the first day we met, like, if I'm on a desert island, all I want is the Madame Glam Perfect Black, right? Or First New Moon. Like, I need... I need that black mani in my life. And, like, I don't care if that's the only thing on my phalanges. But if I'm going to be running out here catching us fish and stuff, I need to have some strong nails. That's all I'm saying. Oh, uh, don't worry. We'll have a rubber base for you, too. Oh, my God. Thank you. <laughs> I will need it. Okay, so... I got to do this damn hot water trick to this. To oh, I did it the other day, so I threw it at my brush. Oh, my gosh, because this one, I told you, it keeps doing the spread eagle thing. Uh, I even saw it in my most recent video. I literally saw it separate. I'm like, oh, my God. <laughs> That's next level. It's the cap. You know, when you put in the freaking cap on. It is the cap that did it, for sure thing is is that i'm so careful when i this sounds so dirty but when i put it in like i'm so careful and i don't know That's what he said <laughs> he still got her pregnant though he was careful oh. Not enough. oh my gosh cinderella black how are you doing honey hey cinderella black she's so lucky to catch us we're so lucky to have you here honey Oh, 
cutting some foil. Right. So I will try yes. Oh yeah. I'd like you. If you want to hear a nail tech, be real quiet. Give her some line work to do. Give her some line work or give her some something shiny to focus on. Ooh, that part. Okay, so I like the little stars, but I'm going to have to... Something about that I don't like. So we've got to wipe it off and try again. So this is the thing that we do. We do that so well. Because I think, like, we all have a vision. And uh -huh. I think that's really cool is, like, knowing when you don't want to cure it. <laughs> when you're like, you know what? That's not giving exactly what I want. So I'm going to go yeah. back in. Because we have, we have the technology and the tools to do so. Yes, we do. And we also know once you cure, it's a little harder to come back from it. So, oh, <laughs> you can't. Exactly. Wipe it's it before. Very hard. Oh, my goodness. Very hard. But we don't do that. No, we don't. Oh, okay. So... This is cool. So y'all, I'm doing this on top of Rudolph, and this is without a base coat. So it's so smooth that I'm not getting any bumps on this line work. So again, like they've really went all out with this formula. No, they did. But you really don't have to It's only because I remember I said that to you the other day. It's only really because you you're gonna really want to seal her in. But yes. other than that, she could actually stay like that. It was the day what? we did the ornaments that I was just like, oh. <laughs> oh yes, I agree. I agree. And I was like, well, this is definitely more... Because, like, I was totally prepared for it to act like a chunky glitter, even though it was fine. Uh -huh. So I was prepared for, like, grittiness and, and all of that. But, nope. Mm -hmm. No, we do things... Even just now, I thought... Maybe I wanted to use a builder gel, and I thought, you know what? No. I think I'm going to use some white and do some outlines. <coughs> and then maybe I'll leave the design in a mat. So I'm going to put mat on top of that. And, Speaking of uh, builder gel. I, I am going to take a little bit of the Pure Serenity Builder, which is from Madame Glam, oh. and I'm going to gonkify this little nose. <laughs> She's like, don't make it too big, because I don't want anyone to call me Roseanne. You know what I mean? Oh my gosh, you're you so haven't got, cute. Like I said, you got no freaking, you got no eyes. Yep. There is no eyes. Well, so that's what just was making me laugh today. I'm just like, you've got no eyes, bruv. Your nose has to be big. Makes it's sense. true, it does. Yeah, if you're... If you're then you're going to need eyes, that part. Okay, what the heck came up in this mix that you want to be in here? You weren't invited. 
Oh my gosh, the uninvited guest. Mm-hmm. Flop or hair? Lint um, or bit? Lint. Lint. And uh, it wants to come up in this clear little gonk nose acting like, excuse me, I don't want you here. Okay, there we go. You're not going to interfere with this nose here. I don't blame you. Mm -hmm. Mm-hmm. Today, it was just like, I was getting like some some stuff from the ether. Literally. (laughs) Like... It didn't even make sense. There's no reason for that to even be anywhere near the, the polish. There's nothing in the house that was like, like what is that? Not okay, out. see, so, so that's what happens to me. And then I, I'm like, I get that I have a puppy. But, like, I'll literally disinfect my entire area, take out a brand new polish, and there's hair. Yeah. <laughs> but what? I, I think some of them are born like that, with, with hair. Yep. Well, it's like, okay, no tea, no shade, but come on. Factories, all sorts of stuff. You can't tell me that there was never a miscellaneous hair that ended up in a bottle. Because then you would be a liar. (laughs) Pants on fire. That part. Oh. Let me close this down. Let me just switch out my tablets. One second, please. Oh my gosh, so I changed Jessie, um, because you know she's been healing from that hot spot. Uh-huh. And um I changed her into my tie-dye shirt that's has Lilo and like it has stitch. Uh-huh. She looks so freaking cute in tie-dye. I need to see. I need oh, to see. Look you know, at all the pictures after that. Because when she wears that onesie, like it just makes me so weak. I actually think I can do the onesie soon. I just, I wanted to wait as that was healing on her. Go forward. Okay, yeah. But she's in bounds. She's a star. Oh gosh, she, she truly is a little superstar. You're a superstar. You hear that, Jesse? She's like, does that mean I get to race? Uh, yes, you do, Bubu. I was like, you know what? We should probably put some magical. Do we want flakes? Yeah, we do. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh my gosh. There was like literally one choice. Do we want <laughs> flakes? Yes, do we do. Do you want flakes? Yes or yes? Which one? Yes? Okay, cool. Oh my gosh. <laughs> She's like, that's a no brainer. Oh my gosh. Uh oh. I what see what you were talking about the little, the little teensy bit of bleeding from the red. Yes. I thought I was imagining it. I didn't think I was seeing no, that. On a lighter background, you can definitely see that. And I did wipe it, but clearly not enough. Oh my gosh. Tell me why that hair just tried to come up in the mix again. Listen, you will never be a part of the nose. The hair is on the beard. Jeez. Oh my gosh. Talk about push yourself. <laughs> Two in it. Oh my gosh. This is really cool, though. Like, it's very Santa's beard. You could definitely do snow with this. The tweed designs are insane. Like, this texture gel is so amazing. Or just do, like, all black with some kind of chrome. And it gives you a multi-dimension, like, if you don't feel comfortable with... Because some people have texture issues. And, like, they could never have a texture like that on their nail. But, yeah. like, that, that doesn't mean that that's the be-all and end-all. You can use it and then top coat it or... Or even put a little builder gel to even it out, but still have that dimension from using foil or um, chrome or what have you. So true. 
I really do love how innovative Madam Glam is, though. And this was a really great thing to put on their roster. Oh, that's what I'm saying. Did not see it coming. I definitely didn't see it coming. Honestly, I wouldn't have seen it coming unless it was for customs. Oh, yeah. <laughs> customs ruined the surprise that my my representative tried because all of a sudden I get a message about, hey, you have this coming. And I'm like, but, but no, <laughs> I didn't make any orders. And this is not on the website. <laughs> what is this? <laughs> You know, because that's the first thing you'd be thinking, especially with fraud. They invent stuff. Oh, yeah. Trust me. If, like, if I hadn't have received a message like that before, like, as soon as I received it, I did, like, completely. As soon as I read it, I knew that it was Madam Glam and that yeah. it was, like, from them. Because I don't know how to describe, but you know the chart they give you that says, like, one item and then list the name? Uh-oh. -uh. Um, I don't know if you've ever paid duties from a Madam Glam before, but the way no. it comes in is like on, um, is it DHL? Yeah, it's on DHL and it shows like a chart. Yeah, because when um, you took a screenshot, that was the only way that I could see it. Like, Oh, okay. So, so see that chart I've seen before for like previous launches. So as soon as it came in, like it didn't make me feel fraud or anything, but I was like, wait a minute. <laughs> I didn't do this. So I can actually take out a little bit of Madame Glam foil. This is from last year. What color is it? Sorry. Yes. You take that out. So uh, instead of the flakes, we're just going to touch a little bit of this. I don't even have my scissors, so we're just going to take literally a little bit of this and apply some pressure. Oh, yeah. Oh. And then any areas that it transfers that you don't want, you can wipe that away, but. Sometimes their base coat is just sticky enough. Like for instance, the foil nails I did on my own nails, it was actually sticky enough that I was able to just. Just use that, use that base coat instead, use that tacky layer, yeah. Oh, that's good. Right, let me think. What do I want to do? Do I want to sugar it? Do I want to form it? Oh. I also like to take sometimes a little alcohol to this because it actually like changes the holographic of the foil a little. Really uh -huh. cool. Yeah, I do like that. You know, foil is very fun to play with. There's so many little things you can do. Very. And even foil can give that flake appearance, right? As uh -huh. if you put fresh flake down. Yeah, I'm I'm very impressed with this this uh, texture gel. It's very cool. <laughs> it's got my sister in the grips. It, 
It does. Oh my goodness. Well, it's cause like when you like try a new product, you don't know, like either it will work with you or not. And then you just feel awkward. <laughs> oh my and God, this God. is like very fun and easy to work with. Oh. And like Lauren was showing you, you can do so many different things with it. So much stuffs. Let's get the top coat. So again, all the texture area does not need top coated. So all that I have to top coat is the little, little nomies, the little gonk nose, his hat, and a little bit of his his, his nomi outfit. <clears throat> and that's cool because that's just the areas probably where you've put um, another product. Let me just check my battery. Oh, cool, we're good. Because I didn't plug it in, but I've got a. I have to put a power source on my table because, yes, it was a power source. Oh, God. Not going to lie. I'm so happy they sent a no way top coat. Why is this has Jesse hair everywhere? Oh, God, no. Wait, on the top coat? Yeah. Uh, oh, my God. My partner just said, do you want help? Do you need help? Oh. <laughs> you know, when you start hearing some flail, right? Like, oh, oh. my God. Okay, I was able to get it out, but just after having a minor heart attack. Oh, gosh, stop this. Well, it's like when you're sealing, you really don't like... It's okay if you get hair trapped before you seal, because then if you cap it right, you won't be able to see any hair or anything like that. Uh. But if you're doing the oven, you get hair in it. It's... Uh, <laughs> it ain't going to give what you want it to give. Oh my gosh. This is like, nope. Please don't do that to me. <laughs> okay, so you know what, sis? I, I opened up the cap and I pulled the brush out and then a hair was like, hello, darkness, dear old friend. Oh my gosh, stop this. I, <laughs> back off, bruv. Back off. Oh my god. Look at these, babe. This is with the texture gel and chrome. Put your light on it. Yeah, Jesse hair is for free. Lee's like, and Jesse hair. <laughs> oh. Yeah, I know. Wizard of Oz shit, right? Yeah. <laughs> She's like, this is some Wizard of Oz magic. Love that. Yeah, look. I said, I said it's chrome, both. Stop, put your light on it. So weird. She's like, that's so weird and cool. I didn't know you could put something on top of it. Isn't that shine your light on top of it? But no, I mean shine your light on top of it. There you go. So that was just playing around with it, which it's like amazing. It's very fun. But look here, I'll show you a little gonk. This is inspired by Mama Does Nails. Like you don't know her government name. I know, right? <laughs> this is just for the audience. For the pick me down. For the fantasy. She said very nice inspo. So Mama did like a heart. And then we both found this mystical one. And I just thought the mystical was so freaking cute. Says our, our little gonk. Aww. So He's freaking so cute. The nose. The nose. Right? The 3D nose. and This feels really cool, but without, like, feeling gross, if that makes sense. Because there's some texture that just, that's a no-go. But, um, you, you've got the option, as Lauren said, you could buff it if, you know, but this wouldn't drive me nuts. This would be okay. But you see what she was saying about that piece? This one's sharp. So you uh -huh. would want to buff that little piece. That was fun. Yes. Go on, so I definitely, I'm not going to be able to do the sweater one that I wanted with it. But that's okay. Um, I still want to try to do it with the pudding gel. Yes. Definitely worth trying. 
because I, I definitely think it's, it, even if it doesn't turn out, it's, it's definitely worth the experiment. Okay, there was um, a video that popped up on my thing and I, I'm sure I've saved it so I've got to check back on it but she did sweat and nails without acrylic oh okay yeah. please, if you if you find that please send it to me because like obviously I can use like um Another option also to try, not just the pudding gel, I can also try the gel paints because those do cure with a non-tacky layer and you can build them up um, as long as it's line work without it wrinkling. If you put too much product because it's highly pigmented, you will have an issue like if you're trying to cover the whole nail. But um, if you're just trying to do like a line work, for instance, I think you could. So there's, we're just going to have to do science. Science, 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 science. Yes. I mean, it's the only way we get the answers, right? That part. Especially if you're not sure, like, about something. Oh, my gosh. I'm so happy I turned my heat on an hour before we began. Oh, my gosh, sis. I actually just noticed that everything I've been doing with you has been effortless. And the last time, everything was frozen, and it was, like, viscous as hell. Oh, yes, because it was cold, yes. Yeah, um, it was so cold. It's still cold, but because I turned the heat on in the bedroom, it kind of evened things out a little bit. That's good. Sis, just let me know when you're finished because I'm just playing around. I was just, you know. Oh, so of right. course, honey. I'm just going to finish doing this one. I was just trying to do a base. So I want to do a base of silver magic so that I can do on the video I was filming just doing a little bit on a Christmas tree. Oh, I can't wait to try that. I just want a rustic Christmas tree, nothing mad. Yes. So I'm not going to go all into high definition on the yeah. branches because that's what this snow is going to be for. Yeah, yeah. You girls are doing great. Gina, thank you, honey. You got to see two gunks in one day. I'm so sorry, honey. I uh, know. What's that? Gunk she, magic. She got like an overload. Gunk madness. Oh. Uh. I hope I didn't drive you gunking mad. <laughs> Sorry, I this had to brush my mouth. I couldn't even laugh. Oh my god! Oh my goodness! It's, it's another situation like the flocking, right? Oh. You're gonna be mad. Not gonna lie, though. So this kind of gives like a fun, satisfying feel, like flocking. Like when you flock, it like gives a raise, and it almost has like a shine to it, and yeah. that's very similar to this. It has a really cool effect. I'm just trying to think what colors do I want to do my tree? I know I've got the perfect green. So you did you see the ones that Lauren used today? She used oh, so she used gel. olive, olive green and army green. And oh army trust green. me, honey. I <laughs> when I was filming the texture, I brought that ish right up with the quickness. Because, you know, Lauren, she puts things into perspective. I really love that girl. Like, <laughs> she's so talented. And, you know, just hearing her take on it. So um, she was saying certain key words because I had never used any of this before. I'm like, can I at least see her do a swatch? And when she swatched it and it was bumpy, I was like, okay. Okay, so it's not smooth. I was trying to get my bearings about it. Like, because it's so that's cool. What I but that's what I messaged. And I said, I don't think... <laughs> it's kind of, it's smooth, but you know, I'm still optimistic. Like, let's try it. Let's <laughs> try it. You know, oh, but yeah, yeah, I mean, whatever the case may be, at the same time, I'm saying that I'll be the same person turn around tomorrow looking for a texture gel like that. Because there's yep. just some things like all this snow we've been doing, especially like, you know, the pine trees. 
that's yes. what it really has needed. So that's what really takes this the white and black texture gel up a thousand is like, mm-hmm. for instance, Halloween, right? You could do a full black nanny and then that one nail you do with the texture gel, use a chrome, and then you have this really cool effect. Or you can get really yeah. detailed and use it for your character and other things to create dimension within your picture. But it's just like the uses are very like endless, right? Definitely it's just versatile. yes, very versatile. You can achieve a lot of things with it. And as Lauren showed, right? You can do tweed, like that tweed design I actually saw from a young woman in Korea. And I don't know what gel she was using, but I remember at first I was like, what are you doing? Because it just looked like all these weird haphazard lines and stuff. And then all of a sudden I was like, wait a minute, she's making plaid. But that's the thing. That's like what um, Sister Gina was saying that, you know, there are plenty other companies I just didn't realize. And maybe they're just calling it something else. And like she said, you know, Brillbird called it, is it Contour? Gel yes. Or yes. So I think you're right, honey. They have to have some that they call a different, um, because I I have seen something out of Korea that has done that, but it's very few and far between. You know what I mean? To find it, it's true. So something like this that's readily available, this could really be a huge upgrade to your. You see, Madam Glam. Always helping you out. This is from last Christmas. This is Drummer Boy. This is a nice green. Uh. Add some dimension. That looks similar to her olive. Trying to find Wicked Witch. Oh, is that another green? Oh, yeah. Wicked Witch, when they first reached out to me, I got Casino. Wicked Witch and Silver Magic. Yeah, here's Wicked Witch. Wicked Witch. Look at this green. Oh. It's giving me very Irish taffy. Yeah, oh God. Blue Iris taffy is like by far one of the fates. Oh, for filigree embossed 3D pan- patterns. Brill bird contour gel. See, so um, I think that's what I saw the young woman that did the tweet. It must have been that that company. Bill yeah. Bird. So let's give them a go. I'm just gonna quickly like it's gonna literally take me two seconds to lay this tree out, and I'm good. So less than T minus four minutes and counting. Get out this petal brush. I haven't heard the voice in a little while, but today I was, because I said to you, I started watching Medium again, right? And why is, it was so creepy. It was a freaking, the guy was using the security system to talk to the kids. And that's how he gets them oh to open the door and stuff. Oh my gosh, but honey. He was trying to put on the voice, and I was like, "You ain't Raven." In right? my mind, it's so funny. I was like, "Raven can do a better computer voice than that." There was actually a, a nine one one like that where the he was yeah trying to... the girl threw the oh monitor. Oh, no, yes. Disgusting. Oh, that scared the crud out of me. I'm just like these people, man. They try anything. So nasty. Like everywhere. everywhere. You go to a library to try and get a book. There they are. They're just everywhere. But yeah, I've got Criminal Minds and 911 to catch up on today. Ooh, honey, it's juicy. Not going to lie to you. Thank you, Reed, and all the goodies from Criminal Minds kept me company as I waited for my package today. Uh-oh, you're getting a call. Do we gotta? Do we got to cut this, sis? Oh my gosh, I'm so sorry. Nope. I knew I knew what that meant. Oh wow. It really always distorts the call. It does. It makes it sound all funny. Oh my gosh. I nearly jumped out of my little bone. 
Oh, honey. I was completely that mom? forget that she. Yeah, of course. Oh. I completely uh, forget that she just does that. I'm, I'm talking I'm, about criminal minds, and you said right. something about read, and then that just made me jump because I've gone into criminal mind mode now. And I don't know why, but I jumped out my skin. But yeah, what were you saying about Reed? Oh, no, I was just saying, thank God they kept me company while I waited for the Madam Glam package today. Because it was oh. a third party company. So like where I live, like it's kind of confusing. And I've actually had them leave my packages in other people's yards. And so like I didn't like I was so excited. It's launch day today. I just didn't want there to be a chance of something happening. So I waited out there and, um, because I had, uh, I had criminal minds keeping me company. So normally I'd have my sisters, but I had no Wi-Fi, so I couldn't use my, um, what's it called? What, um, season are you on? Did you say? WhatsApp. Um, I'm on the, I'm real behind. I'm only on the, I think either the third or the fourth season. Oh, uh, I can happily watch that again but, with you. Okay, sis, so, we, got, we got to plan a Criminal Minds Day. But I was freaking out because one of the young women that passed away in Criminal Minds, it was the psychologist from Wednesday. Oh. And I just saw her get attacked in Wednesday. And then I, saw, oh, I got God, to the episode in Criminal like Minds. Dying like, everywhere. <laughs> why are they trying to hurt this woman? <laughs> oh, my gosh. They're like this poor thing. I, okay, Gina, we will do a, a whole family style. If you haven't got into it, you are, you are, honey. And I don't mean to even say that because, um, you know, when people say like, oh, yeah, you're missing out. I'm like, that's rude. But sis, the moment you watch it, you're going to be like, oh. also a brand new spinoff just came out. Or is it? A, no, it would be a continuation. Yeah. Continuation. But that I was like, is- oh. What uh, what what they've done is because obviously, like season fifteen was pre pandemic season fifteen, which was the last season that was so long ago, right? So this evolution, they really and I like it. What happened to serial killers during the pandemic? Because remember, you can't blend. There's no public to blend. We're all in lockdown. Yeah. So what did they do? Well, that's what Criminal Minds Evolution is about. And oh my God. Stop. Yes. Are you okay? Because, honey, and I, this might make me sound real dark, and I don't mean it to sound that way. But in the beginning of COVID, I asked my partner, I'm like, have you ever thought about the people that might have been in an abusive relationship or maybe kidnapped in the height of COVID? And then mm-hmm. everyone's locked down, nobody's going anywhere. You so, can't like, even go back to the place. Yeah. Yeah, they're just stuck with their abuser, right? Yeah. I so. mean, I thought of that, definitely. Only because there was a big emphasis. When I first started hearing, I mean, it was the stories. I mean, you're talking about people killing their children, their wives. Yep. They were just doing mad things. And I was just like, wait. As there was the world, actually black... more death to trans black people ever and that. during lockdown. And that. Yeah. You know? And... People of color. So freaking like it's, it's so just, sad. It's just mad that you know they came up with a hand signal so that if someone came to your door or whatever, if you went to the shop, you could do this signal with your hand, and then that would indicate that you need help. Help. Imagine. Yep. Like you're just stuck in there with a mad person. Because I can't even say mad man. Abuse nope, can be of any sex. Abuse yeah. is abuse, yeah. It can be of any. And I think that's the the huge thing is people think, oh no, it can only look this one way. Oh no. That's not Mm -mm. true. It's definitely not. You know? And um yeah, it's just it's just really bad. It's really sad and bad. But um, I just I definitely am very happy that they were coming out with signals and things like that. Like they actually put something out um in the hairdresser. That was oh, like, if did. you need help, here's a number. You, you know what I mean? Because maybe yeah. you might only be able to go to that one appointment ever. You know what I mean? Exactly. Mama, that is oh. flawless. Flawless. Oh, this, that thank is you. Gorgeous. Just, 
messing about with some stuff while you were you, gonking out. Do you guys hear this? As I was gonking out, she was a messing about, apparently. No, I don't see no messing happening. <gasps> I am Biscuit! Hi, honey! Hey, we're Biscuit. Playing around with Madame Glam's new texture gel. And Mama is slaying this pattern. Oh, my days. Have you seen, like, the sexy tile? This looks like that tile. Oh, my gosh. You know, like, on Italian floors or something. Yes! Yes! Um, I Am Biscuit said, those nails look amazing, Mama. They look so good. Oh, thank you, sis. How are you? Hope work was good. Honestly, just been a nice, chilled-off day. I Raven said it's launch day today, so... I'm just like, yeah, I'm going to play while Raven slays over there with that texture gel because we got all the questions to ask about right? that. Right? Like, I'm just, happening? I'm really impressed with it. Oh, thank you, know? you, Biscuit. Thank you, honey. I was just <laughs> prepping a, a nail here, but I, I swatched these two, which now you can't really tell. You can, but that they were white and black, but I put a chrome on it. And it gave oh, such yes. a fun effect. Um, but yeah, they just released this texture gel today uh, that's white and black, and it's so beautiful. So, um, uh, someone oh! in the live was saying um, Chanel jacket. So I was like, yes. Ooh, yep. Because that pink um, that Lauren did today, I'm like, oh my gosh, I need a pink pudding gel. Because... Um, I'm trying to think. Did you not get the when the summer pudding gels launched? No, I don't think so. Have, there's a tulip pink. Um, that's this here. This is yeah. very mama. Let me grab it. This is very you, honey. Yes, it looked like that pink that she used. Um, let me open it up. Look at that bubble gum. Oh, yes, that's that's exactly the pink it looks like. Ooh, oopsies. Let's cover that back up. Yeah, I'm addicted to their pudding gels. Their pudding gels are so fun to work with. That's it, Mama. I'm all done. Good night, darling. Yes, my sister. I'm just popping her in the lamp. I definitely had like so much fun though. This was just next level. Yeah. And I yeah. appreciate you oh, definitely sis. inspired me. I'm gonna see if I can hold this in screenshot. There we go. Yeah. Can I see your, your nail, honey? Mm. Oh the gunk. Oh perfect. <laughs> Oops. There we go. Tried to take some screenshots because I'm going to send an email to Karina. Like, I'm still going to do oh. an individual video. But I also, like, the fact that we were live, interactive, playing with it, talking about the launch. Um, I want exactly. to share that as well. Exactly. I just, honestly, Mama, it's it goes without saying. But, you know, the last couple weeks have been really hard. And I'm just so incredibly grateful for you. And our beautiful charm squad, like you ladies and kings, like we all lift each other up. And I think this it's a very beautiful community and I feel very um, blessed. Yes. No, come on. We are family. <laughs> I got all my sisters with me. <laughs> yes. But yeah, just, um, just did something very simple. I'll do the bling and everything off camera because I'm just going to put some blings in that those little squares. But, you know, I took inspiration from something and I just did my own thing, put some foil, some hollow foil. I love the foil, sis. And then I put some reflective squares on the black. No, cat eye. Ooh, oh, my God, sis. Okay, so you know the next time we're live, if those things come, my mouth went dry thinking about it. Um, oh those gosh. reflective powders. Yes. 
the you glitter. mean the, the born pretty stuff yes yeah we need yes. to do a born pretty live like we need to we, do a born pretty we live must. so just let me know when that comes and hopefully as because like my as. stuff should be here tomorrow or like latest by monday so maybe mm-hmm. next week monday we could do a little born born pretty uh live and just play around with some goodies because like honestly yeah. you and Priya really helped introduce me to the born pretty world and like i am so who sis did you not see stuff how much fun do. i had with that jelly polish like Listen, sis, you made me write a list. I wrote a whole list. I was like, yeah. <laughs> I was reading that off a list, literally, when I was saying that to you. I was like, yeah, so I'm going to use this colour, that, that reflective, because I actually ended up getting, it was the same colour that I had. But honestly, it threw me off because my colour wasn't looking like how your colour looked. So I kept thinking it was something similar. And then when I was watching the video, I looked at the number. I said, no, wait. I went and checked mine. I said, it's the same bloody thing. Because at but, first, when you pull it out, right, it looks very cherry cola. I, and actually, very I'll blood. Just yeah, that it. blood red. It's Ooh. very, thank you. It's very blood, blood red. But once you put it on a thin coat, it looks completely different. Yeah, so I said, yeah, I want to see definitely in all the backgrounds what it's giving. So that, that was what I wanted to do, just five nails and literally do that. Um, and then just see <laughs> what that looks like. Let me quickly. You know what I mean? Dude, but, um... I think this is it. Because this got me so confused. Like when I looked at this, this looked like black. So I was very excited because mm. honestly, we already just had a conversation. <laughs> black is my favorite. So I Listen was like, hey, okay, if this is like, I'll just do like a normal Manny. And then when I looked at this, I thought, this kind of looks like cherry cola. But no, once you, mm-hmm. you swipe this, it's very like, it's a very red jelly. Very beautiful. It's, it's absolutely awesome. gorgeous. She's one of the girls. <laughs> she definitely is. Definitely one of the girls. Louis Vuitton, red bottom feel, like sexy. Mm. She's not your bottom bitch, let me tell you. She'll be your top no, chick. No, top chick, definitely. Yeah, that was amazing, sis, as always. Thank you so very much, Queen. It's always a pleasure. (laughs) And thank you, our beautiful family. Because I needed to see this texture gel. Introducing Um, this texture gel. This is not the first time you're going to see this. This is uh, just the start. We are going to definitely bring this back out. Um, And the sisters, we're going to have a play date and all sorts of stuff. So this is definitely... Just need to check this out, mm. and even if you can only get one, remember if you're brand new, oh, I got a clean darn polish. Oh, yeah. If you are VIP and or brand new to VIP, this is zero dollars, so you could technically get both of these for thirty dollars, or no, fifteen because you'd be getting fifty percent off. Yeah, so the VIP, yes, yeah, that's ridiculously good, and like you can do these really fun textured patterns, tweeds, all sorts. So, oh, if you feel inspired good. to get it, definitely tag the Charm Sisters. We'd love to see your creations. Love to see it. But yes, these two Charm Sisters here, we just are, are going to love and believe you. Yes. So, Charm Sisters, out. Yeah. We love you. Ow. We love you. Bye, beauties. Bye, gonks. <laughs> Bye. And, uh, Bye, gonks. So, gonks out. Right. Mother gonker. <laughs> For gunk's sake, Raven. <laughs> For gunk's sake. Oh. <laughs> That's right, a new go one. We're just going to be saying everything with gunk. I know. We <laughs> need to do that as a dare. You know? Oh okay, God. we're gunking now. We're gunking. We're gunking out. Mwah. Love you. <laughs> oh, my God. See you later. <laughs> Bye, honey. Bye, sweetheart. <laughs> oh my god, yes. best family ever. Thank you, Love biscuit, you. honey. Thank you so much for Love joining. you, biscuit. Thank you. And Gina.